What's up, YouTube? This is Cooking with Doug, and I'm back again with my chef favor air fryer slash grill. And quick intermission, this machine is now $100 off, which will bring it to $159. So definitely hit that link in the description so you can get it now. I tell you what, these wings certainly wasn't a discount. Before the pandemic, it was half the price. This is about probably, I'm saying, I'm going to count, but this, I'm, I'm assuming these are about nine wings. Nine, ten wings. Twelve bucks. So I bought two. I want to see how much wings we can get in here. I'm thinking we can get 20 something, 22, 24 in there. I'm thinking. But we'll see. Let's season them up anyway. And by the way, we're making my Cooking with Doug famous Applewood Rub Wings. Okay, I just washed off the first pack, so that was 12. So we'll have around 24, 25 wings. So this will be a good test. Wow, that's a lot of wings. So just in case I can't fit them all, no worries if I can't, I'll just vacuum seal the rest and use them another day. Because we're two weeks away from the NFL playoffs. And big ups to the NFC East because my whole division went to is or is going to the playoffs except the Washington Commanders formerly known as the Redskins which they don't need to go anyway but big ups to my Giants because last time we made the playoffs was 2016 but anywho we're gonna go ahead and season this up and let it sit for about I don't know two hours and then we'll get air fried so let's season so first thing I'm gonna do guys get my Evo sprayer link will be in the description guys you need one of these if you don't have it. If you have an air fryer and you don't have one of these, you're missing out. So we're gonna give that a mix and we do that to keep them from being dry and mostly so that our seasoning can stick. So we're gonna get our go-to. Go ahead and mix that in. And keep mixing and adding till it looks something like this. And then finally, I'm going to add some apple wood rub. And also, you can add some smoked paprika. I ran out. I usually put that in there, but it's not necessary. It just adds a little deeper color. But we're going to add my apple wood rub. And we're going to give that a mix. All right, guys, we're all seasoned up. What is it, 11 a.m. right now? I'll be ready for lunch around 1 p.m. So we'll put this in the refrigerator for three hours or two and a half hours. And for the last 30 minutes, I'll put it right back here so it can get to room temperature. Um, it'll be fantastic. And remember, this machine um, heats on the bottom as well as the top. So we won't be flipping anything. So, yeah. So I'll be back. Turns out it was 21 wings all together, not 24. And we managed to get 18 wings in here. Now, my wings that I bought, these are bigger than average. So I would say average wings, I know I'd be able to get 21 uh, wings in there. So 18 or 21, that's way more than my other air fryers. I usually get between 7 and 8 in those seven uh, I guess seven to ten so I got 18 in here let's get cooking all right let's get it on air fry we're doing 450 I'm not preheating I'm gonna do yeah we'll do 22 minutes and then we'll put some barbecue sauce on and do it for another five minutes or so something like that we'll see we're going to bypass preheat because we can. We don't need to do that. Alright. I'll be back in 12... Uh, well, I'll be back in 20 minutes. Because I don't have to flip it. Normally I would be back in 12 minutes if I had to flip it, but I don't have to. And to my new viewers and subscribers, with this particular machine, guys, it has a see-through window so you can actually see your food as you're cooking, which is unique to 99.9 .9 of the machines out there that you can currently buy right now completely fantastic alright guys we got five minutes left I did take two minutes off the time 
Um, so it'll be a total of 20 minutes because by then for sure we need to put the barbecue sauce on and just let it caramelize and we'll be done. But it is looking really good. It's smelling good too. All right, we're down to two minutes. I got my barbecue sauce and my brush ready. All right, guys, 20 minutes is up. Let's see what we're working with. Look at that, guys. 20 minutes. Now, in the description, I'm going to, instead of 450, I'll say 425 for this machine. 450 was almost too hot. But we're going to flip them over. We're going to put some, ba oh, not baby rays, some Jack Daniels barbecue sauce on this side, then flip them over and get the other side. And we'll do another two, three minutes and we should be good to go. And some of you, I'm sure, want to see the other side. So let me show you. Now that has a um you know some oil on the you know from the drippings so it's not as crispy as the top but it is done and that's why when I do the barbecue sauce I'll flip them over and then just do that side for like 2 3 minutes but smelling and just looking perfect so far look at that guys that's still the same side and flip them over yet but I think I'm going to flip them over into this, the air fryer uh, basket that it came with. Only because there's a lot of oil drippings in here. And I think that will prevent it. it that will take away from some of the crispness of this side. So I'm just going to flip them over in here and then just do another four or five minutes. And we should be good to go. So let me do that real quick. Alright guys, so this is the other side with the air fryer tray. So that the you know the oil is not touching it. I forgot how much oil it produces, you know, all these wings. But it smells fantastic, and I cannot wait to eat these. So we're gonna air fry these for I'll say another four minutes just to get everything, get the caramelization going. And then that's it. I'll figure out what I'm gonna eat with these in the meantime. I might, might, I might make some fries or I might not. We'll see. Oh, but what I want to tell you, you see with the air fryer basket, I was still able to cook the same amount of chicken. I wasn't robbed. Because sometimes when you use these baskets in other machines, you kind of get robbed of real estate. And that's why, that's the real reason why I don't like to use them. Because in other machines, if I use their basket, it would... It would take out, I would have to take out three or four pieces of chicken, or maybe two or three, let's say. And I want them all. I want full capacity. So this gives you full capacity, which is good. But I still would recommend doing it the way I did it because the bottom is touching the heating element. So it's getting the, the most benefit of heat from the bottom um, without the air fryer tray at first. So after the 20 minutes, I mean, if you can. Just put them in there and um, do as I'm doing. We are sauced up, guys. We're going to do four minutes at 450, and then that's it. Y'all yeah, know what I'm about to say. This could be you. 24 minutes of your life. People are going to be asking where you bought this from. And you're going to tell them I made it. Link will be in the description. Stop playing. $100 off. All right, guys. So what I'm going to do is simplify it for everybody since we had to flip them anyway. I just wanted to show you guys that it can cook both sides without flipping. But since it cr um, created so much grease... That one side would be crispier than the other, which is not a problem. But, you know, since I'm doing a video and I'm trying to show you the benefit of this machine, I want to give it the best opportunity possible to do that. So, anywho, in the description, I'm going to tell you, you're going to put in the air fryer basket, like I did after 20 minutes. You put that in initially, season your chicken, all that good stuff. You're going to do 450 for 24 minutes. At 12 minutes, you're going to flip them over. 
and then at the 20 minute mark you're going to add whatever barbecue sauce you want you're going to flip them over you're going to do this side first flip them over do the other side and do the remaining four minutes and be done simple as that all right guys it's time to fix my plate All right, guys, it's paper towel time. And for those who don't know, I am a type two diabetic. So the broccoli, cilantro, and avocado on my fries <laughs> for today. Shout out to my viewers and subscribers that hit the like button way before my video is even finished. I appreciate that. All right, guys, you saw the paper towel go up. That means it's time to eat. Now, I'm gonna take some of my Avocado, cilantro, and broccoli have a quick bite. You first. You got it. Mm hmm. Add some hot sauce to it. Yep. All right. Have some wine with me, guys. Now, between the wine, the broccoli, and the avocado, that's just to brace for impact for the sugar from the uh, barbecue sauce so it won't as a diabetic me eating all of that will slow down the sugar spike so now it's time to eat you first you got it it's gonna be good mmm that is so good man mmm That's too good. Mm. This Jack Downs is okay. It's good. It tastes just the same as honey sweet baby rays to me. Nothing different. But good. Mm. Some of my fellas in the back said, yo, what's up with the flats? And you know it's sticky icky, by the way. You see that? This could be you, man. Mm. It's just too good. Too good. Get some blue cheese action going. Get, grab another flat. This one's for my ladies out there. You got it? Mm. Yeah. That's good. Make sure you have plain napkins when eating this. Got it? Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Woo! That hit the spot. And I'll leave, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description to this Chef Favor uh, air fryer slash grill. And remember, right at right now, I don't know how long it's gonna last. The company didn't even tell me they were going to take $100 off. But it's $100 off right now. So bring it to $150 something with tax. Which is a fantastic price. Don't know how long that will last. So if it runs out, well, the day that I'm doing this video, it was there. So I'm saying don't be afraid of success. Buy it now if you want to get it. All right. And I'll leave everything I did to make these fantastic cooking with Doug chicken wings. Like I said, you could use any barbecue sauce you want. You could use low-carb barbecue sauce if you wanted to. Baby Ray's or whatever whatever barbecue sauce you like. It doesn't matter. I'm a sweet Baby Ray's guy, but whatever you like, fine with me. Knock yourself out. But other than that, man, fantastic cook. 24 minutes of your life. Crispy, juicy, flavorful, minimal effort. No preheat. See-through window. 
Hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. If anything, thanks for just even looking at my video. It's Cooking with Doug, and I'm out.